Good morning students. Welcome to Maths video. In previous video, we discussed exercise 5.4, first sum. Now in this video, we will discuss exercise 5.4, third sum. Check whether the given lines are parallel or perpendicular. <coughs> given straight line x by 3 plus y by 4 plus 1 by 7 equal to 0 and 2x by 3 plus y by 2 plus 1 by 10 equal to 0. Now, <coughs> I am going to verify using the concept of slope. If slopes are equal for the given two lines, then the two straight lines are parallel. <coughs> when so it is given in the form of ax plus by plus c equal to 0 then slope m is equal to minus coefficient of x by <coughs> coefficient of y. x by 3 plus y by 4 plus 1 by 7 equal to 0. Then slope <coughs> m1 is equal to minus coefficient of x 1 by 3 by coefficient of y 1 by 4 minus 1 by 3 and reciprocal of 1 by 4, 4 by 1 this is equal to minus 4 by 3. Second equation 2x by 3 plus y by 2 plus 1 by 10 equal to 0. Slope m2 is equal to minus square option of x 2 by 3 by coefficient of y 1 by 2 is equal to minus 2 by 3 into reciprocal of 1 by 2 2 by 1 minus 2 2 are 4 3 1 is 3 minus 4 by 3. So here m1 minus 4 by 3 m2 minus 4 by 3. So m1 is equal to m2. So, since the slopes are equal given straight lines are parallel. Slope m is equal to minus coefficient of x by coefficient of y first equation 5x plus 23y plus 14 equal to 0 slope m is equal to m1 is equal to minus coefficient of x 5 by coefficient of y 23. Second equation 23x minus 5y plus 9 equal to 0. Slope m2 is equal to minus coefficient of x 23 by coefficient of y minus 5. Minus minus getting cancelled 23 by 5. Equation of slope of the first line minus 5 by 23. Slope of the second line 23 by 5. So m1 is not equal to m2. Then verify perpendicular condition. m1 into m2 is equal to m1 minus 5 by 23 into m2 23 by 5. So 5, 5 can be cancelled, 
23 23 can be cancelled is equal to minus 1 m1 into m2 is equal to minus 1 therefore given lines are perpendicular that's all thank you